Hello. Welcome to this video. Today I want to show you a 3D puzzle experience called Light Matter, which has various good accessibility options. For starters, the game has very little color. It's like a gray and black. So people who are colorblind, they're going to be fine. People who have alternate keyboard layouts, they're going to be just fine. People who uh, have dyslexia, they're going to be fine. Dyslexic font. It's, um, it is a highly accessible game. And uh, check it out. So, this game does not have a native Linux build, but it seems to work just fine. Had to turn the graphics down to get a decently smooth experience. But, uh, it runs alright. Oh, the final tram. Oh no. There it is. I can make it. No. If, uh, and it's gone. Alright. I've. I've already played through the first uh, hour of the game. It lets you play the first hour for free. Or roundabouts the first hour. It depends how long it takes you to get there. <laughs> For me, it was the first 50 minutes or so. Um, humble, humble brag. Not humble brag. That was like an obvious and not humble brag. And it's going to look very silly very soon when it takes me a very long time to make it past the second hour. <laughs> Now, um, I've re <laughs> read a few reviews of this. Uh, one of them who couldn't understand uh, basic English <laughs> um, saying, Oh, it says free to play, but it's not even a free to play. And I was sitting here thinking, No, oh, no, it says free to try. I'm pretty sure it said free to try and very specifically said you can play the first hour and that's it. So I, I made sure, I looked at the Steam page, and yeah, that is what it said. And that reviewer, I'm pretty sure, actually dropped his mark because of that. And uh, that's a little bit... Mm, that's not a good reviewer. I'm not going to say who that was, but you can look it up for yourself if you, if you really want to. And then not trust that reviewer any <laughs> in the future, or at least trust them a little less. Well, there's one of me. If so, I have just evacuated your tour guide. Ah. Panic. I'm not panicking. I'm your inability to follow evacuation chill, chill. orders is truly astounding. But I need you to pay attention. First off, walk through that door. This one. All right. I mean, I can do that. Excellent. You have already exceeded my expectations. Obviously inspired Wait, by Portal. It's dark in there. Um, you, you might trip. Uh, let me light your path. The door requires two people to reopen. Proceed to my security manager's office. Cameras are looking at me. Okay, let's proceed to his security manager's office. Is 
that a cat thing? It's a cat thing. Now I presume you know how buttons work. Cat. And another cat up there. Or what is that? My jump is too fast and strange. Please push the button. Cats. What is that? Is that another cat? Whatever. This guy is not nice. Unnecessarily not nice. Unnecessarily inflammatory. Look at this bit. Oh. The beefcake guy with a cat and then rocks. Right, so this dude is turning people into the. Um, power source because he's running out of the power source and he can't find any more of these crystals to mine so he's turning people into the crystals that's my guess I know it's difficult not to stare at the scientific wonder that is light matter but the launch event is over all right don't worry my facility is sturdy Get it seems room. less than sturdy to me, but whatever, dude. Excellent. The elevator will take you directly to our outpost. When you get there, journalists will immediately try to put words in your mouth. But stand strong and tell them that Virgil, the CEO of Light Matter Technologies, saved your life and that the side effects are under control. Goodbye. I will tell them that Virgil was an unnecessarily inflammatory aggravating inconsiderate um just i don't know I, I if i can think of any more bad words i'll i'll tell them that those but at the moment those are the only ones i can think of basically i'll i'll, I'll tell the journalists think of some bad words just whatever don't matter and and write them down say that that's this virgil guy because that's him light matter Where is it? This way. That way. Alright. So, the elevator... ...was not very good. Can you hear me? Yes. Oh, you can't hear me. Of course. Shadows are dangerous. Stay away from the shadow. Oh, <laughs> just, just barely. I could tell that the time was about there, and I decided to see if I could make it exactly on the dot, Excellent. and I did. It's working. It so, is working. Simple is no longer an option, neither for you nor for me. This was a monumental failure on behalf of my elevator technicians. But don't worry. You will reach the exit of this facility, and they will reach the end of their employment. An escape plan is in development. Until then, keep in mind that the shadows can kill you. Think the floor is lava, just with shadows that absorb organic material. Mm, okay. All right now, here's the plan. The elevator dropped you to the center of the mountain. And the only functioning exit is at the top. Follow the green exit signs and you'll get there. Just do exactly as I say and you will be fine. If you want to complain about that, well, I can't hear you. Just realize how fortunate you are. You've extended your tour through Light Matter Technologies. All right. It's unfortunate. 
unfortunate that the board voted against installing basically um, the facility. <laughs> almost speed running through this oh by the way ramifications. good thing we still have cameras check out what else they have see that these are good developers they know what's up they know how people do things they know what we're up to us gamers ah excellent do you see that lamp down there yes pick it up okay handy isn't it focus groups called it heavy and clunky i called them weak and stupid in the hands of a capable miner, that lamp turns into one of their finest tools. But yes, usually these first few puzzles will take a person Listen, slightly longer than this. To you. A deep black obsidian -like tar that will devour so I'm, ma I'm making this game look very short. But but it isn't as short as I'm making it look. A temporary side effect of light matter. You see, all of mankind's greatest breakthroughs had their kinks, and these kinks are manageable. If they weren't, I wouldn't be here in the facility fixing them. Uh, actually, I'll see if I can take that one over there. I think that's what I'm supposed to be doing anyway. Oh, no, I fell. I don't actually remember what I'm supposed to be doing here. I'm just kind of doing things. Alright, I'll bring this back. Wait, no, hold on. Um... I don't know. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just gonna do this. Don't even remember. Where was this? What? In what way was there a shadow there? <laughs> Whatever. I'll do this. I want to bring bring the other one as well. Can I do that? As soon as I pick it up, it'll be gone though. Ah, uh, whatever. Oh, and I couldn't jump over there anyway, so whatever. <laughs> you know I was trying to think of a way to bring that other one also. These caves? Although I came here with my former partner, Arthur, I was the one who discovered the photon crystals. You might have heard that the side effects of those same crystals cost me my leg. Wrong. I conquered a mountain for the first photon crystal. Sheer persistence and willpower cost me my leg. A small price to pay for light matter. Alright bro, whatever. You're weird. Glasses and crowbar. Ah, there it is. Now, since you missed your tour, that giant beam of light you see is light matter. Whatever, I'm the doing some mask by. We call the core, <laughs> a collection of massive photon crystals. It is so powerful that it shakes the very foundation of this facility. I still remember my first successful prototype. The beam seemed so solid, it looked like light had become matter. I built on that, and now look at it. A sustainable and renewable energy source that will save humanity. Yes, the launch today failed. But these shadows will not deter me from bringing light matter into fruition. Uh, so... Firstly, 
I need to acquire this lamp. Secondly, I need to now that I think about it, put the lamp where were you during the launch event? over the there. Were taken directly to the trap, so you so. must have snuck away somehow. Hmm. What exactly were you doing? Wait, are you a health and safety inspector? No. <laughs> The irony that you didn't notice the blaring sounds and flashing lights. That's a problem with safety procedures. They could never be idiot proof. Yeah, all right, mate. All right. Mate, all right, all right. So what? What am I even doing now? I guess I want to bring that light with me. But do I? Or do I just want to make the light do things? I think oh, that's all I need to do. But that's all I'm going to do. So apparently I don't cast a shadow, which is helpful. <laughs> Otherwise, uh, there would be a problem. So, health and safety inspector, let me do your job for you. You see that giant piece of metal moving back and forth? It's a top-grade mineral decontaminator. Oh, I don't I see it, actually. As soon as I heard that my employees were losing their hair. Once installed, cellular degradation fell by 37%. So, what, what am I doing here? a lot of stress on my workers, as do my 12-hour work days. Point is, there are many reasons for hair loss. This guy, I tell you what, he's full, like, not nice at all. <laughs> Excellent. Our time together is almost at an end. There's a bridge right around the corner. Cross it, and you will be on a direct path to Sunshine. And my security manager, James. Oh yes, he was evacuated as well. <laughs> I wouldn't dare risk his health and safety. Be careful with my lamps. At Light Matter Technologies, we treat our inanimate objects with respect. Not like those monsters of aperture science. <laughs> That'll be fine, I'll make it. See, we're good. We we all good bros. Don't even worry, I don't even know what you were worried about. Take this. Bruv, we all good. Ah, you found a solution. Yeah. Excellent. You leave and I'll be able to focus. Ah, oh, the bridge collapsed. That's why I don't trust you, inspectors. I built it up to code, to what was legally required of me, yet what good did it do? Let me figure out your option. I knew it. They're hiding a loading zone behind this talking. It's loading the next level right now, and then when I go through a part, a little bit past here, there'll be kind of a blur, and that's where the transition occurs between the two, um, 
maps kind of thing. This is still map one or whatever. Or two, sorry. The first load was hidden in the elevator crash. How long does it think my computer is going to take to load this? <laughs> Because it is already loaded. The door is open. Run along now. See that? That was the transition between level one and two, or two and the you know the two levels. It's subtle, but it's it's there. And uh, I'm okay with it. I jumped too early. Yeah, there's a delay on my jumping because of this screen. <laughs> the screen's not the best. What am I doing? This isn't the correct thing. Actually, can I even... Wait, how did I do this the other time? I must have dropped down, but then that doesn't make sense. What? How did I do this last time? <laughs> ah! I see. Okay. So I put it right as far as I can put it. And then uh, I'll wait for it to come back this way. Pick it up again. I want to jump when it's coming towards me, so I don't have to jump as far. Pick up! Okay. Now, I want to put it on this one. And point it. That'll be fine. Much like you. These machines work at a painfully slow pace. The difference is that they are being productive. Whoa, wait, what? <laughs> the shadow is doing weird stuff. Is that thing wobbling or what's happening? Listen, I have a limited amount of patience and this detour is exhausting it. Light matter demands my attention. So you'll be on your own for a little while. Just know that I admire your persistence. With everything you've been through, I would hate my life if I were you. Now, you'll survive as long as you stick to the green exit signs. Good luck. Okay. So, uh, first thing I'm going to do is not do that because. Mm -mm. At the very first opportunity, 
I'm going to not do that. Um, I guess I just want to do this. I don't know. Wait. Ah, uh, wait. Uh, hmm. What's this part again? Ah, uh, ah. Uh, yes, I can go around. Yes. Let's see. Okay. Went it this way also, just because why not? Okay. That's a big kind of hole there. I need a little bit more <laughs> light. Actually, it's not because why not. It's necessary, actually. And for it to be a little bit more precise. That should be about fine. Press! Alright, we all good. We in there. Okay. Grab this. What happens if I do go through there? Oh, I can't. Loaded and it messed up my jump. First off, I am really proud to be an engineer at Light Matter Technologies. But I don't know what the truth is anymore. People are getting sick left and right. Tape recorders have been banned. And now, until launch, all outside communication is prohibited. Not only that, leave permits are invalid. Virgil and Arthur. The pioneers of science. I can't believe they're doing this. They've been fighting each other for weeks, so I knew something was wrong. But I never thought they would lock down the facility like this. I guess whoever is listening to these tapes, if you're in the facility, please keep them hidden. Just until we can get them away from here. To someone who can help spread the truth. When I find it. Alrighty. Well, I want to take that, so I want to move that so far back so that I don't have to jump. Pick up. Actually, I could probably bring that one too, couldn't I? No. The light won't go down there. Wait. Up there. Something like that, I think. 
Is that the right way? No, that's the wrong way. Also, I can't make it over there. I need to be doing this from over there. <laughs> um, yeah, okay. Wait, why'd I do that? Alright. Uh, and it's this way now. Alright. That gets me up there, but I also want this. Okay. So here's where the demo ends. So if you're fast enough, you can finish that hour in um, in 30 minutes. But um, you know, that's only if you've already done it once. <laughs> but anyway, I'll leave that here. That's what the demo looks like, or the uh, the trial. You know, um, puzzles. The puzzles are good, and they will take you a little longer than that. Well, not now, because you've seen the solutions. Um, anyway. <laughs> uh, there's still a lot more to go. And, um... I don't know. This game's cool. The people who make it seem like cool people. Um, they're all over the discussion forums, like, reading stuff. And, um... You know, taking notes. Making sure to, uh put all of the, well, all, I say all of the, there are only a few little minor issues at the moment it seems, and they're uh, taking note of those and uh, should be at least working towards fixing those in the future. Um, I'm currently running this on Linux. This is pra via Proton. No, nothing fancy. Um, I did use game mode run in the launch options, game mode run percent command percent uh, after installing the feral game mode uh, daemon uh, such, uh, I don't even think I needed to do that, it seemed to run just fine otherwise, without that um, yeah, check it out check it out, it's good alright, peace